What? Are we really brothers? Brother in person. 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 Are we really brothers? What you tell me? Yeah. Brothers in person. Hey, this is Redman coming to you live from Death Squad Studios for a brand new episode of Brothers in Cursive. Here's David Lucas and William Montgomery. Yeah, William has the giggles right now. Ooh. What are you laughing person. about? I want to laugh. I, uh, I doo-dooed in the shower earlier. Um, <laughs> I had to do it down with my right big toe. This, this is how we start today? In are front you of bragging? Com- like, what in is front it? of company? Yeah. In front no, of company? Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have uh, Derek Mio here to get. Yeah, we have Derek Mio here today, guys. What's up, everybody? Yeah, Great he, to be here. Yeah, Derek. <laughs> is like, a, <laughs> uh, Derek is a uh, a dope ass comic, and he's also uh, Chester on AMC's The Terror. Yeah. So you got, I, are we gonna play a clip or what do we? I've never <laughs> seen it, so. Uh, yeah, I, no, I, fi- <laughs> I figured. <laughs> I don't You're looking I, at your phone to look at the title. You're I, like, don't, what? I don't think I watch uh, show called. What is the the terror? If you can you do? Yeah, so it's actually the second season of the terror. Uh, the first season was a completely different storyline, so it's like an anthology. Uh, and the concept for the show is to take a historical event and add like a supernatural element to it. So the first season was about these British dudes and the these uh ships in like 1850 and they got like frozen in in the arctic and so like on the show they're being like haunted by this like kind of prehistoric polar bear creature uh but it's really you know about the breakdown between the characters so then uh our season second season takes place during uh world war ii there you are there it is there's that's (laughs) that's the homie right there Uh, smooth face Derek. uh so it's during world war ii when japanese americans uh, get put into uh, the internment camps. Did you guys know about that? In San Francisco? I mean, not just there, but like the, <laughs> in the whole country. Oh, you know what I mean? There are camps like all over the country. Right after Pearl Harbor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's yeah. produced by yeah. Ridley Scott. Yeah, Ridley Scott produced it. Uh, and so Is he related uh, to Coretta Scott? Is she black? Yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> that was Mar- that was Martin Luther King's wife. <laughs> right. 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 <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Ridley Scott. Oh, well, you know Ridley Scott. Uh, yeah, I thought he did Alien, Gladiator. Oh and... yeah, that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's uh, so that so we're getting haunted by a ghost from Japan. I feel it. You yeah. believe in the Bakemono? Shape shifting spirits. George Takei is in it. Wow. Drop the weapon. I love him. Yeah. Yeah. You used to believe in the country. Damn. Star. Anywhere you go. There he is. Wow. Wow, this looks amazing. Actually, it's dope. You guys, you guys have to check it is out. Is it on uh, like any of the streaming platforms right now, or not yet? Uh, AMC How many on demand. Ten. Cool. Oh yeah, Derek was Ten. going for like what six months earlier this year. It was like five, six months. Yeah, in we Canada. shot in uh, Where were you? Vancouver. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. I wanted to. I told myself like, yeah, I'm gonna try to you know do some spots and you know try to get up and like I just I just never did. I was just working constantly. You know, just like how exhausted. many days a week did y'all film? Like five. They housed you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty good, buddy. <laughs> I mean, let's get, let's get right to it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's the check? It's more than I've ever made doing comedy, that's for sure. What's the check look like? It's, you know, it's blue. It was like a blue check. Yeah, you know what I mean? it was like five, a, yeah. five or six figures. <laughs> five or six figures. You know, there were some figures on there. Uh, <laughs> That's awesome, though. Yeah. Right now, I feel does. bad because I was all asking you about your paper. <laughs> right. You have your show. Like, How right. are you getting broke off? Is, is it five or six <laughs> figures? You can't say. I don't even know. I can't even. I don't even know what uh, you're talking about. <laughs> is it like <laughs> this motherfucker? Um, I make uh, $15 an hour at the cell storage unit place. Yeah. And he shit himself in the shower today. <laughs> and he had to push it down the drain using his toe. I didn't even want to hear that shit. <laughs> and you weren't even Fucking like, disgusting. weren't even like blackout drunk. Just you. no, yeah, I went in the. Uh, went he in hasn't the toilet used toilet and... paper in ten years. Yeah, shut up. Nope, he it's goes been right literally yeah ten years. <laughs> oh my god. Well, I guess you're doing your part, you know. Yes, saving yeah. the trees. Yep. 
I just lower. imagine you to have a hairy ass, so toilet paper probably wouldn't be. But good that's anymore. probably better because you could like you just rub it up and it just you know what I mean. Oh, like man. the get your hands in there. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> That's what I do. I mean, you got to get your fingers up in William, there. William, you're disgusting, bro. Come on, I can you show can, you, you how. You can never make me a sandwich. I when was the, you. When was the first time you did that? I don't know. I used to go to the bathroom, wipe my butt, take a break after like 15 minutes because I was still having a wipe, and I just thought <laughs> to myself, literally 15 minutes, and I thought to myself. <laughs> There has to be a better way. I can't do this. You thought maybe just getting a bidet, like that tushy that we have, a, a yeah. sponsor over at Yeah, Coke yeah, yeah. I mean, I thought about it, but then I, I just got in the shower one day, and I was like, wow, this takes 10 seconds versus 20 minutes. Bro, so I, I, was do you, do you I was hooked. I do not believe you were wiping your ass for 15 minutes. I wipe until there's doo-doo not on the toilet paper. Me too, but it don't take 15 minutes. Well, I don't know what's going on, but it would take me 15 <laughs> minutes easy. You need more fiber. Right, but it ever took you 15 minutes to wipe your nah, ass? No, but I also have a bidet, and, I, and it, when I didn't have a bidet, I also used uh, butt wipes, which I think... I mean, yeah. do you use wet wipes, you know? Or yes, do you, you no, I totally have. Paper? I totally have. Yeah, I use yeah. wet wipes, bro. I, this How I go, the first initial wipe is dry, followed by wet wipes, two or three. Three if it's a... Why do you do the first one dry? I don't know, just to get a majority of it out, so I'm not yeah. using a lot of expensive wet wipes. And then, you know, two or three wet wipes, and then hit it back with the dry. When I went to Japan, <laughs> I went to Japan, and every toilet is a bidet. Yeah. You know, and, and, and it's in reverse, right? Yeah. What's that? It's in reverse. Like, you sit front. No, it was no. normal toilet. It was normal... What? <laughs> You know, Someone told you to do that. Bro, you never saw those toilets. <laughs> in, I've been to Nagasaki. You never saw those toilets that you sit like front? When no. you think you're facing the wall? Yeah. No. Like Joelberg style? Never. Bro, <laughs> yes. No, but when I went to Japan and I used the bidet, I was like, yeah. like, it was amazing how like the whole country uses bidets, you yeah. know? Is there any toilet paper or is it literally just bidets? No, they still have toilet paper, but... And then when I came back here, I was like, why don't we have this? And then yeah. years later, bidets are now starting to catch on out here. And it totally makes sense. Like that tushy one that we have at Kiltonia, the sponsor, that's like $69. And now you could just attach it to your old toilet and it five minutes you hook it up and it's you have 69? a bidet. Yeah, it's so You don't even have now. to buy the whole thing You don't have you, to buy the whole just, thing now. It just sprays water in your butt? It sprays water in your butt. Like the one, it how long it, of a spray? Like how long does it? Like a as long of as you want. Like I'll sit there and like for uh, ten minutes. Like and just, yeah, well, one because it doesn't feel bad. Uh, but two, what? it's like Hold two. Up, it's like a lot of times it'll it'll get in there and like you know knock a couple pebbles loose if you know what I mean. <laughs> Jesus, bro, uh, this sounds like fucking anal yeah. sex. Yeah, I went to Japan after we filmed uh, it, this summer, and that was. That was a nice yeah. that was Japan oh, part of, there. Oh, there we go. Yeah. We got the visual. That's mine. That's the one I Oh, have. that's yours. Yeah. But uh the day came. It, it also heats the toilet seat. Uh, yeah, yeah. It also has a fan, so after uh, you go, it, it dries your asshole. A little cologne spritz. Yeah, I got a little more deluxe one, but. <laughs> Nowhere to put your dick? Huh? Why ain't nobody make like a dick hole in the front of the toilet for Mine always just hits the front of the I toilet hate seat, that. and I, I hate think, that. am I going to get some sort of disease exactly. or something? Yeah. I put it underneath the toilet lid instead. Oh, dude, you're disgusting, <laughs> man, man. That is nasty. <laughs> that is fucking nasty, bro. <laughs> but, <laughs> it does but it's a me. padded seat, though, on the, the bidet. So that shit looks nice, bro. Yeah. And it, it, yeah. How is much it, does that whole system cost? Well, the one at tush, the tushy one is sixty nine bucks, which is pretty much all you need. But if you want to go deluxe, it goes anywhere from like uh, four hundred dollars to a thousand dollars, depending on what you want. Like I have one that's uh, I just went balls crazy on it when I bought mine, and I got the one where like when you walk in, it opens up the toilet oh, lid yeah, for you. Yeah, I've saw like that one before. <laughs> no, that's welcome, true. welcome back, Brian. Yeah, yeah. I saw that, bro. I used my boy. My boy has a a, a mansion. Well, I mean, in the south, it'd be a regular house, but out here, it's considered a mansion. It's in the hills, and he got that shit. When you walk in there, the toilet seat open, yeah, and it's yeah. already warm. And it's shit. warm. It's got a light. Yeah, it's, it's nice. It's yeah. weird because I forget that toilets don't all toilets don't do that anymore. So I'll go into a bathroom like, what the fuck? Oh yeah, it's a normal toilet. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's true. They should all be like that. Y'all some nasty ass niggas. The Japanese are civilized. <laughs> so William, tell, where were you last week? Las Vegas, Nevada. I saw that picture with your ass out. Yup, I got the peach on there. Fucking, did you, uh, what'd you, did you gamble? 
Yep, realized I love roulette. I was playing a bunch of roulette. I saw you post a fucking video of a tiger pissing. Yeah, we went to... Uh, Why would that happen? It would only happen with you right there. Yeah, I was talking to him. I was like, if you could pee right now, it's really going to help this video. <laughs> only uh, a tiger would pee in front of you. Command. Yeah, it's a, I'm an animal whisperer. Did you lose a lot of money? I won $80 on roulette, but then right afterwards spent $40 on two cheeseburgers and a french fry. Where at? <laughs> Just a place in the casino. Uh it's so bullshit how expensive it is there. Yeah. Oh my god! It's yeah, Vegas wor- is cheap, yeah. bro. No, it's getting worse. Now you pay thirty dollars a parking. Oh, like yeah. they make you pay for parking now. And if you don't get free drinks, it's like twenty dollars for a Red Bull and you, vodka. You want me to tell you where to go, bro? Yeah. And I hope this doesn't change anything. This is what I do when I stay at the Strip. Go to the Stratosphere, where uh, uh, valet is free. Just tips. Leave your shit and Uber to your hotel. Oh, that's a good idea. Stratosphere, huh? Stratosphere is free. Oh, cool. And it'll be like an 8 $9 Uber to your hotel. And normally I just do stuff around my hotel because I'm at a hotel that's around everything, like the Venetian or the Aria or the Vidara. Yeah, so. Actually, I have an uncle named Richard Stratosphere. So it's weird <laughs> that you stay. That's cool. I'm actually at the Stratosphere this weekend, guys. So if you're in, uh, if you're in Vegas, I'll be at the LA Comedy Club this weekend. Are you really? Yeah. Why didn't you bring me? I, it wasn't my call this time, buddy. Sorry. God, David, I thought we were brothers. Nigga, we just in, in cursive. We in San Diego together next week. <laughs> Why you well, not? That'll bring- be exciting. Go to the Cracker Barrel. I ate there for Thanksgiving dinner. Oh, you did? Yep. Oh, that got, would have been a good Thanksgiving. Yeah, I got the uh, uh, pancakes. No, the. Uh, uh, what's it called? God, it has chicken and like pot pie. No biscuit, like biscuits in there. Chicken. I got chicken and dumplings and three sides orders of uh, fried okra. <laughs> <laughs> what did Erica get? What did you get? Oh yeah, fish and chips. Oh yeah, like a, like our ancestors one. Fish and chips. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you eat, Mio? Bro, I'm trying this vegan thing right now. Yeah, I'm on my pescatarian shit. Yeah? So what? <laughs> just just, <laughs> just a lot just of spaghetti ass. No meat. No. <laughs> 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 I'm a pescatarian now. I only eat spaghetti ass. <laughs> A lot of which fish, would not bro. be in violation of that. Uh, <laughs> I know, right? I mean, I mean, except the meat sauce. It wouldn't, it wouldn't be balanced, but wait. So what? Vegan? So what will you eat on a day? On a man, I saw basis? that documentary. What documentary? Right. The Game Changers. Oh, whoa, what's yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. So how long you been vegan? Uh, two weeks. Oh, nigga, <laughs> you fucked up your Thanksgiving for that. I was yeah, like, should have waited, right? <laughs> I was like 90 days in, so I had yeah. to commit. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I'm, How are you I'm feeling? A light, I'm, a light, I'm a light vegan. You know, I had, I, I had a little bit of turkey. I'm not going to oh, lie. Okay. I yeah, didn't. I'm not. Yeah. I was actually in Miami for Thanksgiving, bro. Yeah? Yeah, yeah I saw that one video. You were in uh, Cuba. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, How you went that? to Cuba? Yeah. I went to, I've been to Cuba. My family lives down there, so I just took a little mini trip down there to see some fan band while I was in my... It's a 30-minute flight. Did you bring yeah. back any good coke? No, bro, they actually took everything I was bringing you guys back. Oh, really? Because I had an issue at the airport. That's why I couldn't get to kill Tony oh. Monday. Yeah, I had an issue at what? the airport. What was the issue? I don't know, bro. Like, it was just... <laughs> I, they were trying to act like the I did. The kilo in your, uh, in your backpack? It, it was just hard, bro. I was stuck at the airport. I had to... Wait, your family lives in Cuba or my, Miami? Some of them live in Cuba and some in Miami. Are they nice? I mean... I not to you. They wouldn't be nice to you. Why not? Bro, like, Cubans have a weird view of American white people. Donald Trump has fucked up the view of white people to Cuba. I had to tell, like, my family that all white people are not evil. Because they call all white people, like, Yankees. Yankees? Uh, yeah. Down in Cuba. Yeah, some sort of. Yeah. That's what I call white or people gringo, from the north. Or gringo, you know. So, uh, what was the things that they took that you you're trying? I to had some uh, Cuban rum. Uh, it's a what? Rum. They don't call it rum. They call it rum. R O N. I had some coffee. I was gonna bring you some coffee, and I had like maybe like what arabica beans? <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> <Some of the laughs> coffee. 
<laughs> and, then I, and then I had like 20 cigars. Damn. Bro, I, bet I brought back a bunch of rum and cigars and like, it was all good. Yeah, bro, but I guess it was a whole big issue because it's not normal for people going down there for like a day and a half. Mm. So like, what the fuck? I like, bro, my, f- my family lives here. And then they tried to charge me like some ridiculous amount of money for my baggage. It was like five pounds overweight and they were like, oh, that How many be- bags did you have? I had one bag. And they were like, oh, it's five pounds overweight. That'll be $150. I said, bullshit. I'll leave whatever. Five I'll pounds. leave it here. <laughs> I'll leave a pair of shoes here. I'm not right. paying you $150. It's corrupt, man. <laughs> you know, but it is what it is. I had fun. Did you go out on the beach? Hell yeah. Did yeah. you get a suntan? Nah. It's Do you have to wear sunscreen? No, nah, I'm black. Do you bro. have to wear sunscreen? Yeah. Do you have to wear sunscreen, right, Ben? No. You do. do you? I do. I know you do, bro. Ginger. You wearing yeah. it right now? Yep. I got a bunch of sunscreen on right now. I'm going to the Schoolboy Q outside. concert later on tonight. <laughs> You're going to Schoolboy Q? Yep. Are you nice. really? Yep. Where's what? that? Down at the, uh, what, Forum? Down at the Forum. What? I like Schoolboy Q. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. You got yeah. a bunch of sunscreen on. Got my uh, pistol in my back pocket. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're going to be you shooting can't, motherfuckers tonight. You can't get in unless you got a pistol to see Schoolboy. That's dope. I didn't even know Schoolboy was here, bro. I'm a Schoolboy fan, but I, would, I wouldn't go to his concert. How come? I like more uh, music at my concert, so I want to hear like live instrumentation. Like I don't just want to see you jumping around to an instrumental. You know, I've saying? never been to a rap show. So what happens? You, you know what I'm saying? Right? Yeah, like, I don't, you're pretty much just uh, karaoke, right? You know? <laughs> you know what I'm I want to see like live music, like, right? Yeah, I want like. What it, about all the theatric stuff, like the Travis Scott or like a Kanye show with all the like? Yeah, is like the only stuff. person I'll see. Yeah. But he puts on such a dope show. I don't. I doubt Schoolboy is popular enough to spend like ten million dollars on a tour. Right, right, right. Well, that's not what I heard. That's why we got tickets. So. What'd you hear? That he spends $10 million literally on a show. <laughs> so that's actually why I'm going. So Pyrotechnics out the frame. Yeah, Choir. Man. Travis Scott. Acrobat. Shit. Acrobats <laughs> up in the ceiling. Kanye started all that weird ass tour shit. And now Drake did it where he had the fucking floating car at the concert. Tesla. Yeah. And then Travis Scott has like all these roller coasters yeah. and shit. The bird flying. I don't like Travis Scott music enough to go. What? It's like, it's drug music. I don't... Drug music. What do you mean drug music? Like, hev- heavy synthesizers. Like, you know... Doo-doo, yeah, doo-doo, like... Doo-doo. Wow, <laughs> that, that shit just makes me want to do drugs that I don't even doo-doo. do. I just want to be on DMT when I go see that shit. Have you done DMT? Never. No. I will what, never. Will you? Will well, you do? I did salvia one time. It was a horrible nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> it was Come a, on, salvia would be hilarious. God. How was that? It? What is that? So I hit it. I was like a so I was like a tenth grader in high school on Halloween night in my buddy Cade Wallace's green Tahoe, and uh, I hit it. Thirty seconds later, we just knew to hold it in. We bought it a smoke. We bought it legal. What is it? It's some sort of plant. Okay. It, used it was. Be, it used to be legal. Yeah, it was reason. legal at the time. I bought it at a store. Thirty seconds into it, I go down because things are horribly wrong. I go up, you know, when two mirrors are put together, it looks like an infinite number of mirrors. Yeah. <laughs> Half of my body was trapped in an infinite number of mirrors. I was frantically trying to climb out. Oh, my God. I couldn't climb out. I went back down again, went back up. Everything's in 2D, like I'm looking at a picture book. Something cuts across my line of vision. It all starts flipping around. Yeah. Go back to it. It was a horrible nightmare and for literally probably 15 minutes afterwards all my brain could think is did that just happen and i would start laughing but not like a fun laugh but for 15 minutes that's all that happened in my brain so for the same amount of time that you were wiping your ass i was on tripping on south <laughs> yeah yeah well, and that's why it's outlawed that's why <laughs> what's the hardest drug you did Come on, D. <laughs> this is the brothers and cursor. Bro. Yeah, my parents watch this. Answer, answer wisely. Yeah. Well, what's the hardest, <laughs> what's the hardest drug you did, Derek? I don't know, man. Don't oh, come know, on, bro. Man. We drank on this podcast. Oh, smoke. Man. This is uh. Oh, what we got smoking. We got to pass on the blunt and then oh you open gosh, up. Gosh, I didn't. This is a little and sign little, off on this. This is salvia. a little spice. This is salvia. This, this wasn't. Is, this wasn't in the release form. Uh oh, what's that guy doing? Is that you? Salvia. That's me doing salvia. Oh God, you're tripping. What?
Where does it come from? A it's plant. a plant. It's like uh, from the mint family, and it used to take. Is it like a country or like a? No, I, I think as you can grow, you can, they actually sell salvia at Target. Like you can buy a salvia plant, but the thing is, is you probably won't get high if you smoke that. But what they do is they take a bunch of concentrate of the salvia. Like I think I did like eighty times concentrate my yeah, first I did time, sixty or something times like that. or something, yeah. and it 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 only lasts like five ten minutes. It's pretty much the same as uh, DMT, pretty much. This, you know, my first time doing it, it was horrible. I, I, I thought my face was melting on the ground. Uh, like, I could, I thought it was on a water slide. I'm, like, babbling. You good, baby? Yeah. What's on? What are you talking about? You're good. You're good. You talking about my face? This is like oh. a... Uh... Look at how sweet you looked, Red Man. How old are you there? Ten years ago. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Red Man. Oh, <laughs> so right. sweet. Oh, you look like Adam Sandler. <laughs> Red man. <laughs> Red man. It's very depressing to watch. It's like a Nirvana music video. Or but I mean, that's not a long time, but it probably felt like forever to you. It felt like forever, and it felt like I was in a different planet, you know, universe. Like, I, I thought my there was people walking around me. And then I, I did it a couple of times. I ended up hating it, you know, after a few times. But it was really interesting because, like, I did it once, and I felt like I was in a kitchen, and there was a bunch of women's legs walking around me. And they're... <laughs> Yeah, and you know it, it also like it only lasted 10 minutes but when you came out of it your body was just so much sweat and like it felt like you just had like i felt so bad for your body like i never did a drug where immediately i went from zero to 100 and i'm just like oh my body feels like i worn out like like i just felt like shit and, took a lot out of yeah you. it took a lot out of you and you're just sweating your ass off it's horrible. I don't recommend it. Luckily, it became illegal, and I don't ever hear anything about it anymore. Neither I mean, do I. Yeah. Well, you just described this me, like me in Tylenol PM. Man, it really takes it out of me. So you're not going to tell us the hardest drug you did, though? I don't, I don't do drugs. You never did E? I've never done E. I've Are never done shows? E. I shows? think I was always scared of E. Those news reports. What the fuck? Look at you, William. Oh, this is William taking salvia. <laughs> How old is, is salvia? This? He looks so classy smoking. He's talking to himself. There's not even anyone. Else. <laughs> <laughs> this music is in his head. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I watched this and I was really stoned. I had no idea what was going on. What is this? Word? A buddy of mine made it when I was living in Denver. Made some. Uh, made it. William buys a slave. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it looks like. What I'm really being a good that I'm known for is um, uh, musical abilities. Um, let me play you a song. Yeah, watch this. I need to get the synthesizer out in LA. Oh yeah. Where do you work, William? What is it? Uh, so there's a dishwasher. Some fucking vaudeville <laughs> shit. <laughs> yeah. Just getting better. This is how you that. wash dishes. Wow, you've had some really killer jobs. <laughs> yeah. It's back there it's for a year and a half. It's so depressing. Somebody's got to do it. And I like that you're wearing Sometimes gloves you so you won't, die. you know, <laughs> contaminate any of the dishes. Those aren't the dishwashing gloves. Yeah, those, and he's on the bathroom floor. <laughs> I was able to do 50 push-ups at a, at a time when I was doing that. I like that little song you're doing, though. Turn this weird-ass shit on. This <laughs> <laughs> fucking... I feel like I'm on salvia right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're on salvia now. Turn this shit off, bro. The fucking shit white people do when they get bored. <laughs> <laughs> The fuck, man! Jesus Christ, man! Don't pull nothing else up, man. Uh, man. Why? I know you don't want to pull up. Uh, oh hell no! Yes. Don't play that shit. What is this? Whoa! What's that? <laughs> uh, this is. A-
bro. <laughs> Damn, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Turn this shit off, man. <laughs> Turn this shit off. <laughs> it's going to blow up now. It's going to blow up. YouTube Turn it. That David shit. <laughs> Someone's gonna see it. I don't know why y'all. I'm asking. Netflix gonna pick it up, bro. I wish I could get in contact with everybody I've done shit with. Ask them to take that shit down. (laughs) (laughs) Jesus. Except ours was funny. Our our joints was funny. Yeah, it was. What were y'all doing? Some videos. Yeah, we did Instagram. uh, Instagram. Uh, It's on Instagram. That's how we met, right? Yeah. How long have you been at the Ha Ha? Maybe like over a year. First first time I saw you was at the Ha Ha Boo. Yeah, I think you had on like a weird jacket. It was the jacket, huh? I wore that yeah. silver jacket yeah. on stage. And then Boo and Yorsi, everyone was roasting me. And I had and this fool is like a drive-by roast. He just comes out of the bar and says, that shit look like, he look like whatever, <laughs> Stevie think. Wonder, whatever. Red Man, what'd you eat for Thanksgiving? You probably ate Popeyes. Yeah. Uh, there's a place down the street called Talleyrand, which is known for their Thanksgiving dinner like every day. Like voted best Thanksgiving dinner in Los Angeles type shit. So every Thanksgiving they just have the the most deluxe shit, and you could just go there for like twenty three bucks, and they'll give you a bag of everything, like turkey stuffing, and it's just. Do you eat it there, awesome. or you take it home? No, I take it home. I live right down the street, so it's it's cheap. You don't have any dishes to clean, and it's like legit turkey, yeah. you know, yeah, and stuffing and shit. Mm. It was good, pretty Me, easy cheesy. Derek, how long you been doing stand up? Man. I want to say like at least three. I don't know if it's been four yet. That's it. Yeah. Derek has some great voices. Hit us with some of your impersonations. Do that, Donald Trump. I mean, listen. When I get on stage, sometimes I do the digital dishes. Listen. <laughs> okay, but there's different. There's different levels. You know, there's different levels. Up here, he's yelling fifty thousand. He's like, he's almost out of breath. Every every word takes his all. And but when it's an interview, when it's an interview, it's very intimate. It's very intimate. It's like a whisper. He's almost inviting you. The Donald Trump of Nagasaki. There you go. Oh, yeah. You got another good one, bro. Do Pablo Escobar. Oh, hola, amigos. ¿Cómo están bien? Claro. What is this? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Red Band plays around all day, bro. This, uh, this is... I do the Barack. Uh, try to do the Barack. Barack. What else you got? Uh, do you have a swamp thing? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> That's your swamp thing. I don't know if I've seen it. <laughs> David, do you do any voices? Uh, Bootsy Collins. Who? Who's that little bitch? Bootsy Collins. Oh. oh. You know Bootsy Collins? Yeah, baby. It's Bootsy, baby. It's the Bootzilla. I'm coming at you with both hands tied behind my back, baby. I'd rather be with you. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, Bootsy, baby. And I do the, the, uh, <laughs> but he got to play when he starts. You know, he gives sunglasses. It's Bootsy. It's like, like, almost That's like funny. Elton John. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm a dude. What? <laughs> 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 Yeah, I'm gonna never do, baby. It's Bootsy. <laughs> oh, stop what you're doing. Because I'm about to ruin you. And I think I got a decent Jamie Foxx. I've never done it out in public. Let's do it. <laughs> Jamie Foxx. Oh, hey, this your boy Jay Fox. I'm over here at P. Diddy's crib chilling with Derek Mio. You know what I'm saying? We out here in this thing, man. It's LA, baby. Sunshine. Jay right. Fizzle. Fizzle to the izzle. My nizzle. There he is. You got to play a Jamie Foxx interview to see if I. He's usually doing some. He's usually doing some on someone else. Hey, uh, don't run the ground. Maybe you gotta play when he's just talking. Maybe if I turn up a top. You're my guest. Why don't you go first? Uh, here's the the. Uh, it'll land on one. You know what's not scene. fair is like if it were, do, I, uh, I love this skirt like a skirt ish. You do, know, do like Jamie Fox. But I'll Jamie never. Fox talks about I'll PDD never get party. to play that. Yeah. You know what I mean? I you can play that. Y'all. Jamie Fox talks about PDD party. This is security. I just want to let you know. This I've is been one of the best. Like, but you, you'll ever. hear the voice like when he tells his story. About what party? P 
P Diddy party. Yeah. Take that, take that, take that, take yeah, that. Yeah. He does the uh, yeah. Mike Tyson. Yeah. I heard your jokes, Jamie. I heard your jokes. What's it like in the foxhole? What's it? A, there are no atheists in the foxhole. There are no atheists in the foxhole. There are no atheists in the foxhole. Are you hanging out with Diddy? Are you? What are you doing? I mean, yeah. I mean, I mean, you know what's crazy? I used to follow Diddy back then. I kind of do. When Diddy had. <laughs> when yeah, so had- what are y'all? What are y'all doing for Christmas? <laughs> Shit! What are y'all's Christmas plans? Man, fuck that! You I don't w- celebrate Christmas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You I got-, got a daughter, man. I gotta celebrate Christmas. Are you Santa Claus? Uh man, them gifts be there when she wake up. <laughs> if she call it Santa Claus, nigga, does she write a list? I don't know. Fucking. Do you bro- check it twice? When a kid is five years old, they say a thousand. Everything she see on TV, she want for Christmas. Do you make so a list? You, yeah, so how do you pick? How do you decide? I, I get what the fuck I want. <laughs> that you want to play with, too? Yeah. <laughs> nah, but I get like normally like five, six things of what she want and then some other shit. Do you wrap it up or just put it by the tree? Or yeah, I don't get it wrapped. Nice. Yeah. You get it wrapped? Yeah, I don't wrap. The fuck? Santa Claus is here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, do you guys want to do one of those things where you dub the voices? Hell uh, yeah, William, the Christmas edition. Yeah, William, you're Santa Claus, and for the first one, you'll be the one that's with him. All right, all right. So here we go. It's a million and a half. Let me uh, first uh, just volume all the way down. Jamie Fox, this one. Jamie Fox, this <laughs> one. Yeah. All right, here we go, guys. Suddenly, find himself. So you're Santa. Will- hey, where's Ralph? Ralph, what have you done? Why are you on this poster? Dead or alive? Please stop. <laughs> oh my god. Are you really looking at that one post? I know. Yeah, that. do you know Ralph? I, I've seen him once or twice. Let me he's, take this he's really hurt. Oh, I, I mean. He fell down steps last night. But, yay! Just. <laughs> Oh shit! This nigga want it. Oh man, this—that's Ralph. That's my brother. I'm worried about it. Ah, that motherfucker stole my shit. He stole my necklace. Like this is Ralph's. <laughs> I had to get this shit back. See, it say Claus. That motherfucker name ain't Claus. Where'd you find this shit, bitch? That's fuck. Man, that nigga tried to cash my shit in on CashForGold.com. But baby, wh- baby I baby. don't want you to arrest him, please. Mm. please. Mm. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> right, give us some Rudolph. Give us some Rudolph. Hey, right, so, right, so speaking of Christmas, is the song Baby is Cold Outside? Is that shit like Outlaw Band? Whatever? Why? Doesn't it have like rape in it? I don't no, think so. No, I it's, think it's a nice what? Baby, song. it's cold outside. Yeah, that one. Isn't that like they can't play it anymore because it has like rape or he No, it's just, I think it's just unlawful restraint, is what it sounds like. If it's anything, you know, it's like. She wants to go, and he's constantly going. But baby, it's cold outside. You can't leave. Get the stay. In, you know, unlawful restraint hey, can is we really some, not that bad. Can we do some Chris, can, we, can we do some Christmas karaoke? <laughs> you want to? What Christmas song? Okay. Well, what let's Christmas? do that song then. Uh, baby, baby, it's, it's cold, cold outside. outside. Yeah. <laughs> I have to go home. Baby, it's cold outside. I really don't know. It's cold outside. <laughs> do you do karaoke a lot? He's Asian. Derek? No, I no. Oh, that's why I'm asking. Really. No. All right, here we I go. can pronounce it correctly, but. Yeah. <laughs> Was it hard getting on that AMC show? Do you think you could put in a good word for me? Yeah, I'll put a good word. You really could? Yeah. Okay. I mean, the show's over, but. Let's see. <laughs> Y'all ready? <laughs> Let's take that bit for Baby, it's cold outside. I'll be Michael Bublé. <laughs> Bublé. Bublé. <laughs> You singing with me, Derek? All right, so I'm Adina. Yeah, yeah. I really can't can stay. I think I'm peak. I gotta, I gotta go away. Maybe it's cold outside. This evening has been. <clears throat> been hoping that you drop in. So very nice. I'll hold your hands. <laughs> They're just like I. My mother will start to worry. 
Beautiful, what's your hurry? My father will be pacing the floor. Listen to the fireplace roar. So really, I'd better scurry. Beautiful, please don't <laughs> hurry. Or maybe just a half a drink more. I'll put some records on while I pour. Neighbors might think. Maybe it's bad out there. <laughs> Hold so on, what's in this drink? drink? No caps to be had out there. Yeah, wait, wait, what's going on? Yeah, yeah so, wait. Oh, shit. Wait, she wait, did get roofie. <laughs> she did get roofie. Oh, fuck. Oh. Bill Cosby wrote this shit. <laughs> Look, he's totally ignoring her. She's like, so what's in this drink? And she, he's just like, baby, it's, it's bad out there. No cabs to be had out there. No cabs to be had out there. I wish I knew how Your eyes are like starlight now To break this spell I'll take your hat, your hat looks swell Why thank you, I ought to say no, no, no sir Mind if I move in closer <laughs> At least I'm gonna say that I try. What's the sense of hurting my pride? I really can't stay, motherfucker Baby, don't hold out <laughs> Baby, it's cold outside Ah, oh, you're very pushy, you know? <laughs> I like to think of it as an opportunist. Oh, is this part of the song? <laughs> is this part of the song? What the fuck? Is <laughs> <laughs> this the real song? Look, <laughs> I simply must go. Baby, it's cold outside. The answer. <laughs> is oh no. yeah, this shit is creepy. <laughs> no. Yes. The answer is no. But baby, it's cold outside. The welcome has been How lucky that you dropped in it's So nice and warm Look out the window at that <laughs> storm mm, My sister will be suspicious <laughs> Gosh, your lips look delicious My, my brother God. will be there at the door Waves upon a tropical shore My maiden aunt's mind is vicious Gosh, your lips are delicious <laughs> Well, maybe just a cigarette more Never such a blizzard I before I didn't even smoke <laughs> I gotta get home Maybe you'll freeze out there Say, lend me a coat. It's up to your knees out there. You've really been grand. I feel when I touch your hands. But don't you see? How can you do this thing to me? There's bound to be talk tomorrow. Think of my life, long sorrow. At least there will be plenty implied. If you caught pneumonia and died, I really can't stay. I think we should do this Baby, every single it's level. Cold. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, it's cold outside. Okay. okay, fine. Just another drink, then. That took a lot of convincing. <laughs> Great! Yeah. Great! That's fucked up, man. Is that consent? <laughs> It sounds so much different when you you read the lyrics. <laughs> you like, you like when it's terrible singing and it's just two dudes reading the God lyrics. God damn! Wow. Yeah. That was. Uh, I bet karaoke blew the lid off on a lot of songs. Like, wait, oh, wait a second. Is that what they said? God, that Pina Colada songs. That's probably <laughs> one of my favorite. Just. Hey, uh, can can William do a uh, do a karaoke Christmas song? Yeah, give huh? me this. All right, here we'll we'll do a. Uh, here we go. I saw mama kissing. Let's go, Will. Three, two, one. Wow, mommy's kissing Santa Claus. There you go. I saw mommy kissing Santa Claus. Uh, underneath the mistletoe last night. Why are you looking at me? <laughs> <laughs> like, she didn't see me creep down the stairs to have <laughs> <laughs> She thought that I was stuck in Tough my dog. bedroom fast asleep. And then I saw mommy tickle Santa Claus. She was trying to get some extra shit. Underneath his beard, so snowy white. Oh, what a laugh! It would have if Daddy. You don't like the last words <laughs> of the sentence. <laughs> you, don't, <laughs> you don't mess with the last word. <laughs> it's like you don't trust it or something. <laughs> 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 I <laughs> did. I really did see mommy kissing Santa Claus. What do you mean, so daddy kissing Santa daddy. Claus? <laughs> I'm gonna tell my daddy. <laughs> Hold on, where is my daddy? Oh shit! Let's do uh.
Karaoke Temptations uh, Silent Night. Silent Night? I didn't know the Temptations did a remix of that. Yeah. Silent Night. Is it a baritone? Oh, at first he starts deep as fuck. All is come. You guys do this before? Not just because I'm on no. the podcast. <laughs> okay. Bro, there's no format. Like, we do every I'd be like, this is a little... <laughs> Gonna bring out some like chopsticks and <laughs> sing with me, guys. Okay, just so just as long as y'all have done this before. <laughs> it is nice. It's nice. It's, nice. it's festive. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> Is this because I'm on the show? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. It's kind of a thing. I was just vomiting. <laughs> oh, my God. Take your ass off. I was just vomiting. vomiting. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Dude, seriously, I was just vomiting. What a Where? nightmare. I had to keep it in my mouth. Where'd you? It came out of my nose. Why? Oh, my God. <laughs> Turn this shit off. Yeah, turn it off. Oh, my God. No, we had planned on it. David, uh, David was like, yeah, he's Asian. And I was like, what should we do? <laughs> I was said, maybe karaoke or something. He was like, that's a really good idea. Oh, my yeah, we got a hibachi it. chef coming in. Yeah, we're going to do a hibachi tutorial. <laughs> Actually, Richard Tutorial is his name. He's uh, from the island of hibachi. <laughs> <laughs> that's not funny. <laughs> Yikes! Hey man, do that shit over there. Yeah. Look at his eyes; Come on, they're dude. so red. Go to the go to the shower with that, William. Jeez. I don't take showers. I was gonna ask if you if you, you shower. Do you shower? Yeah, in just the go to the bathroom in the shower. No, I don't take them. Okay. Jesus. I bathe in the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> I shit in the shower and I bathe in the toilet. Yeah, do the math on that one. <laughs> hey. <laughs> 36. 36. Oh, we could have a math off. Oh, oh shit. Y'all think I'm better than him? Uh oh. Oh, yeah. Do you I know guess. math? Fuck yeah, I know math. All right, ask, ask some questions. Okay, let's do a couple. Let's start it off with just a. Uh, <laughs> let's go. Let's start it off with maybe a simple. Uh, hey, let's go. 15 times 20. 300. Got your ass. It is 300. Yeah, what are we. Okay, <laughs> yeah. Right. Whoever Call it out first. Whoever, whoever says it first. first, yeah. 275 times 13. Oh, come on. That is 8,250. Can we check that? Hold on. What is it? 275? Times 13. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I got that wrong. Let's, that was hard. What that about a uh, what about uh, uh, 16 times times 8? That is 144. 148. 128. God damn, I'm off today. Uh, yeah, what's uh, going on? I just got off a flight. He does I just got off a flight, man. Come on. All right, hit it. Will. What does that mean? You got off a flight on the map? <laughs> My fucking brain... Right, they look. do different math over there. <laughs> Let's go, Will. Uh, 105 times 15. Oh, come on. That man. is, oh, uh, let's see. That would be <laughs> 15. Wait, what is it? That's 1625. 105 times 15. Is it 1625? 1570. What's going on, David? Fuck. You've Fuck. always been really good at this. I'm sucking today. All right, let's go, Will. What about uh, 13 times 12? That's, uh... That's uh, one fifty. One fifty six. Thirteen times twelve. One fifty six. Yeah. <sighs> okay. What about a seven times seven? Forty nine. Uh, six f- times eight. Forty eight. Uh, two times nine. Eight eighteen. Eight. What do you say? Eight eight. eight. <laughs> um, what about seventy times times seventy five times five? That's three seventy five. Uh, Is that right, Redman? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Two eighteen times three. Six fifty four. What about two nineteen? This is times embarrassing. Four? Can we stop this? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna get you with the karaoke and just blow it out of the water with the math. Oh, you can see. Yes, All right, let's give, karaoke give us, and give, math. Give, than give us like days. five more. Um, what about three seventeen times three? That's nine fifty one. Is that right? Hold on. <laughs> yep. Got it. <laughs> Faster than red hand. Oh, yeah, faster than the calculator. Faster than the calculator. 
<laughs> what, else, what else you got, Will? Uh, uh, 16 times 8. 144. 124. 148. 128. 128. 128. 128. Oh, uh, um, the ball sack. <laughs> yeah, he got. All right, so I'm like up three. Ew. What else? Hit 16 me. times four. <laughs> 64. 16 times four? 64. What about 958 times four? That would be. I don't want to do this. 30. <laughs> that's. <laughs> 958 times four is 3816. I don't want to do this. 38, 32. Fuck, I'm tripping right now. Something's off. Yeah, I think I'm it's off. ever since you went to Cuba. What happened down there? <laughs> yeah. What happened down there? They wouldn't get, let you on the plane? <laughs> they they switched at, least, out. at least you're first. They dude. switched me yeah, out. Yeah, did somebody switch you out, David? <laughs> <laughs> I got switched. <laughs> did they switch you out? The other dude. <laughs> the other dude knew his times tables. Is this really you, David? Did somebody switch you out? Switch Y'all out. found out I'm a clone. Mm-hmm. He used to sing What's on a cl- What's that? He used to sing on rhythm. Yeah, so I'm better than an Asian at math. Tweet that. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all witnessed it. Good yeah, for you. Yeah, tweet it. Good for you. Good for you. Uh, so I heard your jokes. Tell us more about you. Dude. I heard your jokes, Jamie. <laughs> uh, I'm going to be at the rec room in Huntington tomorrow Beach. night. Yeah. Huntington What's your Beach? best joke? Huntington What's Beach. one of your best jokes? Oh my god! Um, what do you? What's one you? I like to do fun? voices. I like to do voices. So I. I what's your favorite voice? Um. Uh, probably Barack. I like Barack. You know. What's uh, your best? Because you could you know uh, buy yourself some time. Uh, Can you freestyle with Barack? Before. Yeah. So here's the thing. Uh, I think I think Barack could do anything. By if the way. we drop a beat, can you freestyle with Barack? Well, here, but yeah, we'll do that after. But I'll say like I think Barack could do. Like, he could freestyle. He could do anything, including freestyle, right? But like, well, I didn't vote so for him. I tend to not believe that. I'm you can, a big you Republican. Not, I tend to not believe that. So if you did believe it, then you would vote for him. Yeah, probably. You could pr- phrase it that way. So who you vote? for it depends on their freestyling yeah mike huckabee one of the best <laughs> <laughs> what about ted cruz cruising through these streets kamala harris dropped out of the race i saw that she wasn't gonna win anyway how you feel about that i wasn't gonna vote for her ass she ran she ran uh la horrible i mean california horrible By yeah look way, at all the homes i got hairy legs that turn that 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 that, that turn uh, uh, um, blonde in the sun. What? The kid what? used to come up and reach in the pool and rub my leg down. This some shit he really so said. and then watch the hair go back up again. They look at it. So I learned about roaches. When I was this? About kids jumping on my lap. Uh, recent? No, I think it was recent. Yeah. Oh my god. He was trying to run for president. He still is. That's Barack's vice president, right? Yep. Man. Oh shit. That <laughs> motherfucker retarded. Dick, hold up. Dick Cheney shot somebody, right? Yep. The nigga while hunting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This motherfucker's crazy. And by the way, you know, I sit on the stand and it get hot. I got a lot of, I got hairy legs that turn, that, 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 that turn uh, um, blonde in the sun. What? And the kids used to come up and reach There's no the way that's real. Is that real? There's no way that's real. So I was trained and then watch the hair come back up again. They look at it. So I learned about roaches. I learned about kids jumping on my lap. What? And I and just look at the all, background. Look at the crew. Front of all these black people. Look at the crew he's with. I learned about roaches. <laughs> I learned about food stamps. And it get hot. I got a lot of. I got hairy legs that turn. I learned that, about that, karaoke. That, that, that. I learned about karate. What, what, what city is that, that in? What does it say? Well, well, Wilmington. That's uh. Yeah, but this motherfucker crazy. Why does that look like uh, the crackhead we had on here? <laughs> Oh, yeah. by the way, he left his hat here. Uh, Did he really? Yeah, so if you want to. It looked like that? It looks exactly like that. I'm not giving it to him. <laughs> you give it to him. I wonder how he's doing. <laughs> you want to call him? I wonder how his Thanksgiving was. You want to call him? Do you? Can we call a crackhead? He got a phone. Put on speakerphone. Just hide the number. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we had a former crackhead here a couple weeks ago. Who, who, and, who uh, booked him? Like, how, how uh, did you get in touch? Uh, David's friend. He's a comic. Ah. But he used to be a crackhead. Somebody sucked on his penis for crack. <laughs> for him to get the crack or the yeah. other person? Oh. 
Let's see if he answers. It's weird. <laughs> Answer, Jeff. Like it was for the benefit of the sucky. Yes. In yeah. that transaction. But he got the correct. Uh, yeah. yeah. He must be smoking. Please leave your message. For- <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah bro. Fucking. Your brother. What the fuck is Brian doing? Yeah, I just now uh, <laughs> caught on to it. Yeah, so uh, now is the portion of the show where you interview us. Okay. Yeah, what are some questions? Yeah, how'd you get... Oh, you got me. You met on Kill Tony. You met on Kill Tony. Tony Kill. Where are you from? Yo, oh. I'm from Memphis, Tennessee. Oh, yeah? You ever yeah, been his, to uh, Tennessee? His, I've been to Nashville. His grandma, what's yeah. her name? Fanny? Fanny, Tennessee? B. Vance. B. Vance. God rest her soul. He used to actually own my grandmother. So that's ah. how, Yeah, that's how we're brothers. Kept it in the family. Yeah. Like, they purchased... My grandmother. Shut up. Fool. Through a four-way deal. Yeah, they, yeah. I mean, it was far too expensive. It turned into a nightmare. They, they had a mandingo, and uh, at the plantation my grandma was at, they traded one fighting mandingo for four comfort girls. And his granddaddy had an affair with my... His granddaddy cheated on his grandmother with my grandmother, who it was, was a comfort, comfort girl. And that's how my mom came about. My uncle's name is Richard Comfort Girl. That's, I think, where he gets that name. Yeah, because um, then, like... Wasn't it, that Django Unchained? No, because, like, in the 1980s, uh, I think they translated Comfort Girl into Lucas. Wasn't that what happened? You guys got this story down. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's almost unbelievable. I can't... And then they opened up a, uh, a oil company, Lucas Oil, and then Lucas Suitcases. Lucas, Lucas Best Suitcases? suitcases yeah. the side of the Mississippi. Yeah. That's Lucas Oil right there. It comes from the uh, lubricant lubricant that the slaves used to actually use to have uh, sex with the white men. You're of the Lucas Oil? Well, that's just one facet. Red of. and tacky. <clears throat> that's an old uh, Montgomery joke, so right? You can find that love. Spray right on your asshole when you're in the shower. So, uh, yeah. Okay. We don't make chicken grease, just uh, car grease. And what I was couldn't, the other eat, one? I couldn't eat it anyway. I'm vegan. Lu- Lucas, uh, suitcases. Lucas suitcases. Yeah. Lucas with a K. Yeah, that was the uh, yeah. Lucas luggage. Lucas luggage is actually what they call it now. It used to be Lucas suitcases. So how hard was it to get on that AMC show? Is it hard reading lines? How do you do that? So look at that, Lucas. Look yeah, at it was that. a lot. Look at that. You it was a that? lot of meetings. Put uh, in the code. Audition. Slave master. <laughs> <laughs> different scenes. Different scenes. How many auditions did you have to do for it? Dude, it was the most I ever had to do. It was like, I don't know if it was like 10. Maybe, 10 auditions? Maybe more. Well, like meetings, you know, whether it was with like the casting director, or the director. Is it hard or, memorizing lines? Yeah, but I mean, no. You spend a lot of time no. doing it? I mean, you could. You memorize, you memorize jokes, right? Yeah, but it takes a while. Yeah. I think that's yeah. the hardest part. And I've only done small th- little one Yeah, I've always wondered things. about that. How hard is that memorizing lines? I see, what his, hard. see what his net worth is. I want to see what he got paid on this. <laughs> Where are your parents from? Uh, Okinawa. Oh, Japan. No, they're from uh, Long Beach. But Dad, Dad grew up in Wilmington. Okay. Mom grew up in Japan, actually. Gotcha. She grew up in uh, Tokyo. Her dad was in the uh, military, American military, and uh, so she grew up on an American military base. What's your girlfriend in Japan? Amber Tokyo. Amber Tokyo. Who's that? Amber Tokyo Drift. She's in it. Let's oh, Amber moment. Stevens. Let's give a moment of silence for Paul Walker. Yeah. I cannot believe that guy's not still with us. Yeah. <laughs> what? Paul what Walker. I mean the. Just those movies, the car movies. That's God. tragic. Can you Horribly play, tragic. Can you play an instrument? I played taiko drums back in the day. Hey, what's that nut sack? Can you hold a nut sack? What are you about to do? No, just hold it. Hold the ball sack. <laughs> Derek is never going to come on this podcast again. <laughs> I guess you should have watched the episode. <laughs> you make every guest do that? 
nah, hold the nuts. Bro, we make him do all type of shit. Hold these nuts. We try to we try to give Jeff a hundred dollars and make him fucking smoke crack on air. <laughs> he wouldn't do it. No. Good for him. Hey man, I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. We've actually hung out a couple times since the episode. I went yeah. that. I got his phone number. We've been hanging out some. Mm. Nice. You guys know Aiko Tanaka, the comic? Yeah. She's in Tokyo Drift, which so it's, this is the scene from it. Oh, uh, really? Yeah, she's the girl that goes like, get ready, set, go. Ready. Set, go. Her? Go. That was her? Yeah. Would you like to oh, fight the- This is just her role. I thought they were going to show the whole role. Oh, Aiko's old if she was in this shit. <laughs> Asians, be the love bug. Asians are young until they're not. Right, 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 right. <laughs> <laughs> it happens like 23 over the- and then like See, 89. Isn't that crazy? That's Ico right there. That's crazy. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I, what'd she say? I like my car to smell good, so I always have my black friend because they always smell like a cocoa butter. <laughs> <laughs> She's great, man. Yeah. Ico's funny. I haven't seen her in forever. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. She's been going back to Japan, I think. Doing uh, comedy out there? I don't know. I don't have no idea. Massage parlor. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> they got the best hands. The little hands. I used to have this. Oh, my God. I was so pissed because the girl who used to do my massages went back to college. Oh, my God. That bitch was the perfect size to walk on my back. What was her name? Uh, her name was uh, Amy Massage. Amy, Amy Massage? Massage? Yeah. Massage. That's her natural. <laughs> that's, her, that's her birth. That's her birth name. Would it feel uh, good walking at her back? Hell yeah! You're pissed off. She went back to college. Yes, bro. <laughs> She's studying. I have no clue. I didn't even. After they said she don't work there no more, she went back to college. I kind of tuned out. <laughs> Just life in general. Someone's gonna find her. She's Maybe. gonna reach out. You like that nitro coffee? Yeah. I, I, I got a pee, but it's all good. You know. You can go to the bathroom and go. Can we take the camera there with you? There's one under the seat already. Okay, cool. Yeah, go ahead and pee. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Have you ever seen baby massage videos? Bro, have you ever seen them massage videos where they're doing yoga with the baby when they're swinging them and shit? Oh, yeah, that's fucked up. Shit. Play that shit, bro. Yoga yoga massage. Bro, where they're swinging the kids around. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I put, like, baby swinging around. Is this one? No, nah, this not one. You like baby videos. Look at Ralph. <laughs> <laughs> swinging from head. You ever just see baby swinging like with dad's uh, shocking footage of women swinging a baby by... No, I don't want to uh, see that. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> shocking uh, footage of women swinging a baby around by the head. There it is. Controversial baby dynamics. Where shit look? Yoga. And the babies, are they crying? I don't even think they're crying. <clears throat> That's, wow. not, that's not real. That is real. Bro. It's fucking white people. <laughs> oh, white people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Fucking white people, bro. Oh that's fucking weird. <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> what bro. are you doing? <laughs> what the hell? Look at this shit. Oh bro. my god. <laughs> ah, it's a street baby. The <laughs> baby's <laughs> naked. <laughs> baby's crying. <laughs> How is this good for a fucking baby? Baby is crying. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Look at the face. Like why? Her pussy must think. He oh my this. gosh! <laughs> All the other white people let their fucking kids do this shit. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> 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 this is retarded. <laughs> Bro, what if a kid gets, like, SIDS? It's just not good. There's just people handing babies to other people. Hey, let me take that. These are, kids. <laughs> These are parents who don't give their kids immunization. Oh, God. These poor babies are like, get me out of here. They fucking breath. <laughs> These bitches breastfeed oh, into look their... Look at that. What are you doing? Is that breaking all his bones? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> this it just is... cracked every bone in that baby's body. Uh, oh, oh now God. they're drowning in the babies. <laughs> oh shit! Play the video of the uh, the priest baptizing the baby. Oh yeah, you ever yeah, seen that? Yeah, one? Yeah, like yeah, he's yeah, drowning. Yeah. He's like shoving it under the under the water. <laughs> oh my God, that was weird. <laughs> Look at this shit. 
Oh, you get. That's how his ass roll. Watch him. That's a slippery baby. <laughs> this ain't the one, is it? No. I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. This ain't it. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> This one might be better. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, too much. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga. I did not expect that to happen. That's fucked up. You know what one of my favorite videos is, Red Band? Hmm. Oh, What's your favorite just, baby video? Well, look at this shit. Who? Huh? Yeet? Yeah. Soldier Boy in that hoe. <clears throat> Yeah, 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 yeah. Why won't these people leave the babies alone, man? Wow, oh, Jesus oh, Christ! Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, oh. Why? 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 Hey, bro, play the fucking video of that dude barely patting people down. Security guard bullshitting, like patting people down. Oh yeah, guard. Lazy pat down. <laughs> yeah. Lazy pat down. Oh, this shit is so funny, bro. This shit is so fucking funny, dog. Look at this shit, bro. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Okay. I hope they don't do this at the schoolboy Q show tonight. Bro, look at this motherfucker. <laughs> this motherfucker don't give a fuck about his no. job, bro. That motherfucker don't give a fuck about his job, dog. That shit is so funny. Oh, my God. Putting in the effort, though. You got to... I right, play this uh, little Jamaican song. Nobody can cross it. Nobody can cross it. Yeah, just nobody can cross it. <laughs> Clifton. Clifton, Mister Clifton. What is this? <laughs> it, it was a newscast that they turned into a, a music video. Nobody can cross it. Nobody can cross it. Nobody can Where's this at, you know? Jamaica. You can't swim. So basically, he was saying that nobody can cross the river unless you're a fisherman or a fisherwoman. Even a bus cannot cross it. Yeah, I mean, look at that river. That is a swift. That's a swift-looking river. Yeah, nobody. Can I don't want to cross that. I wouldn't want to cross that. I could swim. I'm a hell of a swimmer, and I wouldn't want to cross that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now he's on Def Jam. You got a. You got a contract. What? Did you just see what that baby? baby? <laughs> what the hell is Wait a second. Was that a <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Their baby's revenge. Is haunted. <laughs> the babies have Why infiltrated. Was that on there? Oh my god, uh, the babies! I watched I watched so many movies coming baby. back, dog. The Would you baby. on the plane? Yeah. Would you watch Child's Play? The original the movie about uh, the car. That no, can no, no, talk? no, no. The new one, the fucking gender neutral Chucky doll. Was that the documentary? No, no. This is the gender neutral Chucky. What the, the name Red of the movie? man, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is... It's sweet. I like that. It's Christmas season. <laughs> He's going to start swinging the baby monkey. Yeah, it's a Christmas yeah. season. Yeah, start <laughs> start See, swinging this is the normal. Baby I want some milk. I need some milk. Play that video <laughs> called the Ambulance. Call the play. What's it called? I think I think it's called called the Ambulam. A M B Yeah, call the Ambulam. There there. Turn this shit up. Call the Ambulam. It's re- <laughs> remix. <laughs> call the Ambulam. <laughs> call the Ambulam. <laughs> you need to remix that. <laughs> Call the ambulance. Call the ambulance. Call the ambulance. Let's go see what's going on on TMZ. Call the ambulance. Uh, I was looking earlier at. Here, uh, I gotta go pay. We're almost pay. done. Nothing Ooh. really insane happened. Biggest thing was that Jay Leno joke. Oh shit! I had uh, 
I uh, I didn't have dinner, but I was at Swan last night, which is an upscale restaurant in Miami, and uh, Kim K and some of her friends were there. And guess who was on my fucking flight this morning? Kim mm. K. Kim K. Yeah. Kardashian. Mm-hmm. Did she, she say hello? Uh, no. If I was in first class, but I was in business class, I would have said hello. Did she look good? Uh, or was nah, she in disguise, was, kind of? N- it, Bro, you know what's crazy? I had a flight at 8, and I missed that flight, and I was able to get the 845 flight. Um, Why'd you miss it? Dude, just too early. <laughs> <laughs> what time was it? Huh? What time was your flight? Too early. 7, and I got to the airport at 7.30. Oh, Jesus, dude. So they were like... Yeah, you can't do that. Why'd you even go to the airport for uh, that late? Well, by the time I went to check-in, it was 7.30, so they were like, you can get on the next one. It's not full. So. I always go crazy early nowadays. Yeah, I think next time I got a flight like that, I'm just go like four o'clock in the morning. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, sleep there. I love red eyes. Those are the best. Just being able to sleep. I got here at yeah like ten. Yeah. yeah. I'm just glad it didn't crash. What does that mean? Just the airplanes crash sometimes. Not very often, like domestically, maybe internationally. Internationally, there are a couple bad. There's this one bad one. If you get a. Oh yeah, that was a recent one, right? It's some man. It's some website that has like the pilot's last words and stuff, and oh, it's yeah. a, a Tokyo of flight, the and the pilots are yeah till the very end, till they hit the water, trying to save it. Oh, yeah, my but God. You, that's the how that's scary what, would that be? I don't want to be on a on a plane going down. It that probably wouldn't the, hurt though, would it? Uh, they said, would it hurt? Oh damn! Look at if that. you slam into the ground, I don't know. If you kept your eyes open, maybe? a plane. I mean, Amer- <laughs> America's pretty good at training their pilots to fly through all. They got what fly- is this? Uh, it looks like an engine failure. America's pretty good at training their pilots to fly with engine failure and all type of Is shit. Is those 737 Maxes? Two of crash. them are going down. I was on the 777 30? Does that have two decks? No, but that shit had like four sections. So. Did it really? This is my first time being on an American domestic plane that big. Oh my you God. know, normally when you go into the plane, first class is all to the right, right? You know, Not I, just to the right, right? Yeah, what do you mean the right? I don't right. know what that it's means. It's the front, front section. The, yeah, f- the whole front. Oh, okay. No, listen. When you go in a plane, normally when you go in straight and you go right, that's first class. Left is the pilot's Oh, class. you're saying yeah. first yeah. class is to the left. Yeah. Right. Oh. First class was to the left and to the right. And to the and left. And then business class. And then you had the, the, what was it, premium coach. And then you had regular coach. It had like four or five sections, bro. What are people just real sick and coughing back no, in coach? This, this What's going on in coach? big. Yeah. Sounds like Snowpiercer. Whatever that is. It's a film. Hell of a I movie. I hate that movie. I'm kidding. I haven't seen it. I've heard of it. It was a nightmare. It was a nightmare. It's <laughs> after a plane crash. Everybody off. 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 You guys seen anything lately? You guys go to the movies? The last movie I saw on Thanksgiving was Queen and Slim. How was that? It was pretty good. Is that based on a true story or no? No. I don't, know. I don't think so. Yeah. It started off like on a Tinder date, and then it just went left from there. But they, they shot some cops. They shoot yeah, a cop, right? it was right? crazy, bro. It's so a then, preview. So then they're, on, good, they're on the run after mm-hmm. that. But like they lived their life. They lived like a whole life in six days. They did more in six days than most people probably do in a lifetime. Like they fell in love with each other. They had they fucked. It actually looked like they had. They probably had like the best car sex scene I've ever seen. Don't spoil it for us. I'm just saying. I rewatched Boys in the Hood. That used to be my favorite movie as a kid. It's yeah. it still holds up, man. Hell That's a, yeah. still a great movie. Hell yeah! And it didn't really ruin anything. Ricky, but can you drive? Ricky, stick? I got to work with uh, Morris Chestnut on uh, Rosewood. He had a show called Rosewood. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I forget you was on a lot of shit. Yeah, that was cool. That was cool. I was waiting to tell him. How many things have you been on? He's on he's um, on Hawaiian Five O. Thirty. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Thirty something. He's in the emoji movie. Yeah. You're in the emoji movie? Yeah, I'm the elephant. Damn. Damn. Wow, did we do that together? So you don't have a day job? Uh he drives no. for uh post <laughs> You don't work at a storage unit place. Sex bomb. So you <laughs> No, I used to do I used to do valet. How was that? That was Oh that was yeah, fun, it's pretty good man. tips, it's, isn't it? It's just fun, man. You're just hanging with the guys. You know, you yeah. see some celebs come through. I met your Blake boy. Blake Griffin, Judd Apatow. I met your boy, the white boy. 
I guess y'all used to work together a minute ago. Oh, shit. Henry? No. He, he works at uh, STK Valet. Yeah, you hit me up, right? When you met him or something? I, I forget so. what his name was, but yeah, it's cool. You mean a bunch of different people. Well, I hope he doesn't watch this if you don't know his life. name. I saw Drake at the valet. It was late. What valet? <sighs> Can I say? I don't it was that. in Santa Monica. It was in Santa Monica. And uh, it's late night. Were you at Boa? No, I was at where I'm doing at the... Uh, Chili's? At a hotel. At a oh, hotel. Uh, and, oh, you're uh, at the, uh, so these, the Double Tree Inn. Uh, the La Quinta? Oh, was, no, no, it the, no, no. was it the Santa Monica Motel 6? The no, Motel 6, yeah, oh, yeah. That's yeah, what Drake yeah. pulled up. The yeah, nice one. Yeah. Motel 8? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Six. It's a Red River Finn in Santa Monica. He yeah. owns it. He owns yeah. the Motel 6. The Days Inn? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what happened? So these SUVs pull up, and, you know, we're like, all right, this is somebody, you know. And it was late night, so it was, like, kind of empty. And there's, like, a long driveway to the main street to where they turn off the road. Right. To where they pull into the hotel, and this fool gets out. I'm like, yo, that's Drake. And no one believed me. No one believed me. They're like, what? Shut up. And then, then so it was him and then like four just like huge bodyguards get out and just like walk him up. And it, it was like a standoff. No one said shit. So I like broke the silence. You know, I was like, hello, sir. Welcome. Uh, maybe we, can we assist you in any way? He's like, ah, oh, nah, I'm good. He really said, oh, no, nah, I'm good. He said, nah, we good. <coughs> Did he walk where's inside? That, was it nice about it? Where's the elevator? Where's the Ooh. elevator? Whoa. Whoa. Where's the elevator? All these, all these hey. on that oh, yeah, that's dope, boy. Hey, play that video <laughs> of Drake's new... Uh, Drake has his own plane now. A company gave Drake a plane. He's been having his own plane, huh? No, he has, like, his own plane. Like, a big-ass... Air Drake? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was his, like, 2009 to 2019. <laughs> yeah, play the top I hope they stay safe in that The thing. OVO plane. Go back. That was, yeah, like, his 09 to 19. But a company gave him that shit. That shit dope, bro. A company gave it to him, and all he has to do is put gas in it. <laughs> Damn, that's nice. <laughs> yeah, but putting the gas in it's probably yeah. like, oh, you just, it's $400,000 yeah, 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 yeah. just to go to San Diego. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you think that much? It's it's not that much, but it's definitely probably expensive. Yeah. Probably like 30K? It's, yeah. It's gallons. <laughs> 30,000 gallons. Yeah, what happens if you get turbulence and some shit like that? I mean, nowadays Hopefully you're strapped. It's out. really you're pretty safe in an airplane now. I mean, autopilot's pretty pretty good nowadays. Right. Unless you're on that fucking plane where that pilot uh, Sully manually flew it into the mountain. Yeah, in Germany, yeah. that would have been the biggest nightmare of all nightmares. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been. Is the there biggest. a gym on that bitch? Oh no, I was about to say, what the fuck. <laughs> Yeah, the co-pilot left the thing, and the guy locked it locked and just out. flew it into the side of a fucking mountain. Had I been the co-pilot? And they tried to get in with, like, an axe. They couldn't get in. Oh, Yikes. Know. Ever since 9-11, them doors are pretty... Yeah, they gotta have... They well, gotta someone, on, that. someone on the flight needs a fucking... That goes to show... Was that an international... A spare, a spare key or something? Was that an international flight? Yeah, who's got the spare key? <laughs> hey, where's the spare? Who got the spare? <laughs> was that an international flight? Because I thought on every... Coat hanger? Who got the coat hanger? Yeah, um, is Ralph here? Where's the coat hanger? <laughs> on every domestic <laughs> flight, isn't there a marshal on there? I don't think everyone. I think some. What are you, a snitch? You yeah, know what I'm saying? Snitching, like, for the, the major cities. This guy got switched out by the Cubans. Now he's just looking for information. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, damn. I love these uh, like Asian remakes of news events when they have like really bad CGI oh, like, and yeah, stuff like that. Yeah. It's one of my favorite. Oh, things. is this the one? Yeah, this is the. I think the. You know they love they video remade. games. Lean back, I want to see. This is the one you guys are talking about. Yeah, it's a recreation, though. Hey, how's it going, everyone? Where uh, are the welcome guys? to flight five hundred two. I've been pretty down recently. Um, if my co-pilot exits the cockpit, there's a decent chance I'm gonna lock him out and <laughs> slam into the side of a mountain. Hey, how's it going? If you can uh, look down uh, to our bottom left. Too low. Too low. Wow. You're going too low, William. I just want to let y'all know it is so nice. So uh, that was that's on the black box? Yeah. There's no voices. 
I wonder what he was doing at this point in time. Just knowing he's about to smash into it. And pulling up and pulling down. I would have jumped out. Yikes. There should be some AI that just takes over at this point. Yeah. Boink. See, they're probably, there's no way that could hurt. There's probably no way that hurts. <laughs> Do you think? There's probably, no way. It'd probably kill you so fast you don't have It'd time. It'll disintegrate. There's no yeah, way that hurts. Yeah, that, that It'd first, probably hurt for a second, second and you're like, that first second. ow. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. By the time, time you finish, ow. <laughs> <laughs> the strongest pain you've ever felt, and then just nothing. And then you better believe in old Jesus, because <laughs> oh. the way you say it. You would have liked last week's William. There was a lot of God talk last week. Yeah. Is it really? Who was the per- who was that guy? Do Beasy. Hey, so uh, this is how we end our episodes. Uh, can we get that beat? We need a freestyle from Barack Obama. Uh, check, check, one, two, uh, one, two. Uh, here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, bust shots at you and your crew. Uh, with the 12 gauge or the 32. Uh, both of which should be registered, by the way. <laughs> what is this? Freestyle what? Japanese type beat Japan. <laughs> Letting y'all know I'm the man. Chillin' with Red Band, D. Lucas, and Montgomery. Yeah, we coming through, and we hungry for that vegan type of food. No meat, you know what I mean, girl, no meat. Now you know me, coming through. Yeah, I'm hoping, bust a shot, go D, drop a beat. Whoa. I work at Kmart. I shop kinda fucking smart. Give me that Ralph's card number. I wanna put it in. I'm about to spend a lot of fucking money. A hundred dollars worth of celery and apples. I do this shit cause I like to drink from the Snapple tree. From the Snapple tree. <laughs> by a beat. My face swole up. My mom didn't know it was me. She said what's was wrong. Me? I got an allergic reaction. I come through, I drive on the streets with my tracker. Balls hanging out my short when I walk down the street. Do this shit, I like to eat uncooked fucking meat. I'm a pescatarian, give me that sad man. Don't pronounce the L, say that fucking sad man. Sad man. Biscayne Boulevard. Man. Snapper with the heart. Uh. Sad man. William. 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 How's it going, y'all? Welcome to the flight deck. I'm pissed tonight. I don't need a mic check. What is this, a flight deck? Welcome on my plane. I don't have too many plans this evening. I'm gonna run this fucking plane into the ground. You feel me? I've been pretty... Into the ground! <laughs> Into the ground. When you look around, we going into the ground. Into the ground. A lot of trees. A lot of fucking bees. William, run the plane into the ground. Into the ground. Thank you all for being on this flight. It's flight. been pretty nice. Oh, you didn't flight crash 187. Yet. How's it crashed? All the way yet? to heaven. Do that shit just like that. He got seven. Who's in the bathroom? Get him out. I'm trying to crash this plane into the ground. Get him out. Get him out. Put him in the cockpit. Do this shit. I'm about to rub on my dick. In the cockpit. <laughs> Cold pilot. Locked him out. It's very silent. Listen to the, the spare? black box. Who got the spare? Who got the spare? Hold on. This is black box on. I'm pretty. <laughs> <laughs> And that's how you uh, end the fucking crash. brothers in cursive hey, with Derek hey, Mio. Hey, Derek Mio didn't know what the fuck Derek. was going on for ninety percent of the show. That's what we like to do with our guests. Hey, it's fun, man. It's Just give me on that AMC show, okay? I promise you, I can memorize lines. I'll be able to do it. Just 
Got and you. guys, and Ridley Scott. Uh, Red Ben's out of town next week, so we're gonna try to find a guest studio. So if you guys got a guest studio for us to film Brothers in Cursive in the Los Angeles area on Tuesday or Wednesday, hit us up. Chill. And where can people find you? Uh, at Derek underscore Mio on the gram. At Derek Z Mio on Twitter. See you guys. Brothers in cursive. Are we really brothers? Are we really brothers? What you tell me? Yeah. Brothers in cursive. Brothers in cursive. Brothers in cursive.